Write the form of the partial fraction decomposition of the rational expression. It is not necessary to solve for the constant. So meaning we will just decompose it. Uh, we will just do the step one of decomposition. So here we, what you need to do is you need to look on the denominator. So we will have x plus 2, x minus 3, and x minus 3. So we will have 3 because this is to the second power. So the first one you can say it is a over x plus 2. Then the second one we have b over x minus 3. Then we have squared, so you will say c over x minus 3 to the second power. So that's how you will do the one with the second power. Remember, we don't need to do uh, solve for the constant. Now, for number 8, we have x squared plus 7. So you will base this in the denominator. The x is squared, so you will say ax plus b over x squared plus 7. Then plus, it is also x squared plus 7, but to the second power, so you have cx plus d over x squared plus 7 to the second power. So you see the difference between the two, how you will solve this problem. So if there is no squared in the x, you will just do a, b, c on top. But if it is squared in the denominator, then you need to start doing the ax plus b, cx plus d, and there is another one you will say ex plus f, etc. So that's how you will solve this problem.